Getting away for a winter break is not quite as easy as it once was. Exeter Airport's departure lounge was quiet this morning and those who were jetting off had to clear a few hurdles before they even got on the plane. We're from near Loswithiel in Cornwall and we're travelling up to Edinburgh, hopefully for a four night stay. It's been a bit hit and miss, the family torchlight procession has been cancelled and then yesterday our Airbnb was cancelled at four o'clock for Covid related reasons. But we're still going. <laughs> we're going to have a good time. I think it's a balance. For us, we felt that taking the plane up there was less of a risk than the train journey all the way up. And it's a long time since we've been away. And at some point, you've, you've got to find that balance and, and live. Regular travellers are becoming familiar with pre-flight rituals of COVID tests, passenger locator forms and vaccine passes. In the end, like many other things, it all comes down to personal choice. If you feel it's safe, I think you've got to do what you feel is right. Don't be put off. I feel really safe flying domestically and you don't have to do any of the PCR tests and things like that. Um, I still do a lat lateral flow just to be on the safe side. But yeah, very safe. Don't be put off. <laughs> There's always going to be a risk for like anything. So as long as you keep your safety in your mind, then I think it should be all right. This couple, newly arrived on a flight from Belfast, even had time for a quick game of ping pong before continuing their journey. We are visiting my his family. family. They've yeah. just moved, so they've never been here before. And yeah, my brother's just had a little baby girl, so we're coming down to see her. I've gone back and forth a few times. My sister got married last year. It's been quite good in terms of masks, sanitising. The flight attendants being very on it with making sure people are wearing things properly. It wasn't very busy. They're very quiet going through security and stuff. Most of the flights from Exeter today are domestic internal ones, but the rules around travelling to other countries are changing all the time. Places like France and Germany, for example, are restricting visitors from the UK, but other countries will accept vaccine passports. If you're planning to travel anywhere over the next few days and weeks, the latest advice is all available on the Foreign Office website. Sam Blackledge, ITV News at Exeter Airport.